Alrighty then. Da da! There's what it looks like. So we have a, a small desk. Uh, I went ahead and stayed with the cedar motif on the sides, you know, over here and all the way around. One drawer, one cabinet. Decided that was just the best way to do it because I can put files. I can stand uh, manila files upright in there. I'll probably put a small half rack to hold those. And uh, yeah, there we go. And the chair here, it swivels. And then it's hard to do with one hand, but the chair will tilt open into the hallway, which allows you access. You can see the hinges right there, which allows you access uh, into that box underneath where I can put heavy stuff down in there and that'd be just fine. But uh, there's what it looks like right now. And I know somebody's going to ask, so total cost. Uh, hmm. I'm going to say it was just right around $90. Uh, the bulk of that money being the one sheet of three quarter inch plywood that was used under here and some of the scrap left over was used to build this box. In fact, I've got a very little of that left over that worked out pretty good. And the uh, $35 I paid for this carpet remnant. So that was, you know, close to $65, give or take, uh, in and of itself. So, you know, miscellaneous fittings, screws, um, the drawer slide mechanism and all that. Yeah, I figure about 90 bucks. So, can't can't complain too, too much. Uh, not when you had to build all that structural. So there it is, a little miniature office inside of the <laughs> airstream trailer hey thanks a lot for coming along for the ride on this one uh, fair winds we'll see you next time around